welcome and welcome back. We are obviously again playing Greenlight Valley. We're in that playlist, aren't we? Um, <clears throat> my goodness. I spent a lot of time building up some dream lights so we can unlock a bunch of biomes and stuff. So we are going to go to the quest because I believe to unlock any of the biomes we have to do something first. And Merlin keeps saying something and I don't... We have to get rid of the darkness around the valley? Is some... He said... Talk to Merlin. Okay. Where are you? Where's Merlin? Uh, in the peaceful meadow. He's at home. Okay. <clears throat> it is quite the walk, isn't it? I just learned about fast travel. Among My goodness, people, I'm excited. I need your help. Uh, I need to talk to Merlin. Well, yes, hello. you, sir, with the beard. <clears throat> oh, hello. Uh, the port of many worlds. Uh, you're right on schedule. I've just remembered something of the utmost importance. There is a hidden place in Dreamlight Valley which, from which you can travel to the furthest reaches of this world. The furthest reaches of this world. Words. Where can I travel to? <laughs> well, I'm sure in time you'll learn of countless places to explore. Well, what see... we seek is in the Dream Castle. Meet me there whenever you're ready to begin your journey. We have work to do. We have work to do. Let's go. To the Dream Castle! To infinity and beyond. So many random phrases pop up into my head all the time. It's really hard not to, like, switch my conversations. Wait, in the castle or out of the castle? In the castle. Okay. You remember the last video? I was talking about me getting my ears pierced. Well, they're still itchy. I don't know why I'm wearing this headset. I decided I didn't want to wear the earplugs. Uh, Merlin. Well, hello. Oh, hello. Ah, now then, beyond this gate, you'll discover places that will change everything you know about Dreamlight oh. Valley. Oh, where did I put that key? Hmm. Hmm. Maybe up your butt. Just kidding. It's in the library. With the candlestick. Just kidding. All again. I hope not. <laughs> I hope not too. There are more than 72 ways to catalog a key. 72 ways to catalog a key. If I could think of 72 different ways to catalog a key. <laughs> it could take weeks. Aha, uh -huh, I've got it. It was sewn into a tiny, I don't know, I pressed the button too fast. I hope it's the right one. Let's try it. Eureka, it worked. Well, what are you waiting for? Step through the gate and find out what's on the other side. I can see I tip my hat to you. I tip my hat to you. Well, I bite my thumb at you. Being hilarious. Oh. I'm on YouTube. I can't say that. I shouldn't oh, say that. Hello. Uh, remember that well is a source of great power. Use the magic it bestows upon you wisely. What? The port of many worlds. Excellent. Welcome to the Stardust Port. From here, you can explore the furthest reaches of this world. There are countless locations around Dreamlight Valley that you, you've you yet to visit. Huzzah! I must say, I'm looking forward to the adventures and discoveries that await out there. Is this safe? Will I always be able to come back? Of course, in the blink of an eye, and the villagers here will be able to visit you whenever you, wherever you go. To infinity and beyond. I did just say that, so I had to pick that one. Precisely that spirit. That's the spirit. Words. Whenever you wish to venture somewhere else, simply approach one of the con 
conveyances awaiting here for you. Conveyances? I dare say that as you keep discovering more locations beyond Dreamlight Valley, the Stardust Port is sure to fill up with countless ships, flying contraptions, chariots, and the possibilities are endless. Exploration awaits. We have work to do. Okay, that's complete. Oh, oh, hello. Okay, friendship is everything. Do you need help, Merlin? The new enchantment start quest. There you are. I'm conducting a study of the magic in the village. Will this help me open biomes? And I could use your assistance. What do you say? Let's do this right now. Marvelous. Now to assist me, you must first hone your magical skills. Tell me, what do you want most from magic? Uh, to help the valley, of course. A noble goal. Of course, it's a lie. We shall begin by gathering dream shards. They're a potent material used to craft many magical items. You'll find them trapped inside the night thorns. Thank you. Okay, Thank now there's I... one more quest with you, Merlin. What the frick frack? You have a lot of stuff to talk about today. I don't even want to talk about it with you anymore. You've returned! And none the worse for wear, I see. Why do you sound so surprised? Well, there, are me there may have been a slim chance you wouldn't come back, stuck in the realms with the others, ahem, <clears throat> forever. Excuse me? He literally thought I wasn't going to come back. Why would he send me? Did I forget to warn you? No matter. It was but a trifling danger. Nothing to fear. <laughs> oh. But you were still surprised. Okay. As I always say, nothing ventured, nothing gained. And now that you've returned safely, we know that it won't happen. Now, there's something else I wanted to talk to you about. You may have noticed the giant pillars scattered about the village. What? They are strange. That might be, but it's time to understand what they are. We'll start with the one in the meadow. Follow me. Look at all this no. Dreamers. You're doing quite oh, wait, I forgot. I can fast travel. I learned how to do that. You go to your map. This might take me longer than it would to just walk. Oh, I can't go on my map in here. I lied. I lied to you. Do, 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 do. My earring itches. Okay. Where's Marilyn? Where's my capybara? Ah. Isn't that what we were working on? To the pillar in the meadow. Oh, is it the one down here? Oh, goodness. This is the one I've been waiting for. To unlock. Since the entire beginning of the beginning of the beginning. Because this is like my third time resetting this damn island. Village. Okay, Merlin. This pillar is just one of many scattered around the village. For as long as I can remember, the pillars protected the valley and kept it safe from dark magic, but no longer. Such a shit. I'm afraid the pillars are broken. <laughs> I don't really care how they break. How do I fix them? By making them whole again, find the vital pieces missing from each. Each pillar once contained an orb of virtue. The orbs are filled with powerful magic, and each one stood for a virtue around which the ruler... Uh, the old ruler built the valley. These virtues are some of the most powerful kinds of magic there are. Trust, friendship, power, just to name a few. Power is one of the virtues. Power can be virtuous if it's wielded wisely, which I'm afraid it is. it rarely is. That's how we've ended up with such a magical mess. So what happened to the oh. orbs? When our ruler disappeared, some were lost, oh. some were forgotten, and others were stolen for their magic. I have to find the orbs to keep the village safe. Exactly. As long as you keep what's best for the village in your heart, you'll stay on the right track. Now, the pillar held the orb of friendship, one of the most powerful orbs in the village. That orb is now tangled in a night thorn, fiercer than any you've encountered before. Since the orb got stuck, the well in the middle... The well in the meadow fell prey to a curse, and we can no longer use it. 
You must free the orb from the thorns by providing, by proving, words, um, that you have the power of friendship. I'm an awesome friend, Merlin. Ah, a little modesty wouldn't hurt you, though. My bad. That was rude, Merlin. I'm modest. I'm so modest. We mustn't forget about those who are already here, trying to rebuild their lives. Ah, yes. Small acts of kindness go a long way. You know, like giving someone a gift just because you think they'd like it. Spending time together. What do you modern kids call it? Hanging out? <laughs> yes, Merlin. Ah. Uh. <clears throat> so talk to the villagers to get to know them. Most importantly, let them get to know you. Once you understand this, the orb of friendship will be yours. Return it to its rightful place, and the curse wounds as well will be lifted, and we can unlock the biomes. Let's go. Onward. La 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 la. You. I'm going to start with Scrooge. Let's take a seat. No, don't go anywhere. I need to talk to you, sir. Good day, dear. Thank goodness you're here. I need your help with potentially supernatural matter. Ah. <gasps> Ooh, supernatural. I like it. I was exploring the dream castle, looking for hidden rooms and treasure troves when... Bless me, bagpipes. <laughs> I think I saw a ghost. Bless me, bagpipes. Oh, yeah? <laughs> the dream castle is haunted. Ah, it's possible. My ancestral home, Castle McDuck, had ghosts and apparitions clear to the rafters. But this specter looked different than any ghost I've ever seen. It flickered in and out of sight. Since you're an adventurer like me, I want your second opinion. Could you go to the dream castle and look uh -huh. for the ghost? I last saw it at the valley. Oh, at the valley. At the very top of the stairs next to the fountain. Hope you have a thank you kindly. That was two sentences, Scrooge. Who are you, me? Hope you have a very thank you kindly. Okie dokie. Am I not the only one who heard it like that? Or did I just, am I, am I? Oh no! Reach level five with three villagers. This is the worst poopy rony. That's fine, that's fine. Because guess what? We have quests. Search for the specter in the dream castle. Let's go. Okay, but what is it? Oh yeah, the map. I learned how to fast travel today. That's wrong. Press X, I think. Aw, oh, man. It only takes me to the plaza? I can't go to the dream castle? That's not fair. Also, this is black. I can't see anything. Okay. I really need to get some food so that I can zoom around on my zoomy feet and glide along. But no, I'm just walking around like a human. I shouldn't do that. Who's the specter? Oh, is it Vanellope? Stop it. She must be up by the fountain if it's Vanellope. Who's the specter? Tell me it's Vanellope. Oh, it's a little Vanellope. Look at her. Thanks for stopping by. Finally, somebody's here. Wait, wait. I've been rehearsing for this moment. Greetings. I'm Vanellope. Von Schweetz. Princess and president of Sugar Rush and slaughter race driver extraordinaire. Who are you? And what's this freakishly sparkling place? And this is Dreamlight Pally. How come you're here? Technically, I'm not here. I don't think I'm anywhere, actually. I'm everywhere? That's the thing. I don't know. Normally, I have complete control over my glitch, but one day, pow, I glitched onto this freaky network I've never seen before. Now I'm stuck. I have no control and I don't know why. Magic and technology don't always mix, Penelope. Maybe the dreamlight magic here is messing with your glitch. Why am I not surprised that a place called Dreamlight Alley is lousy with magic? There's got to be some way I can help you. <laughs> Do you have one of those doohickeys where you talk into it and it takes pictures? Because I have an idea. Do you mean a phone? Yeah, that's it. I'm seeing a lot of photos being shared on the network I'm stuck in. If you try taking a picture and sharing it on the network, maybe we can see what it's all about. 
But hey, leave the castle and take a picture of something awesome, will ya? Show me what I'm missing. Come on. You can't stay- you can't say no to this face. Look how adorable I am. I mean... Okay, fine. Your voice is kind of annoying, but I'm gonna accept it. Ooh, can only be accessed using your dream snaps feature. I don't care. Oh no! I don't want to do a dream snaps. Okay, reach friendship. What the poop? What did she need? Participate in the dream snaps challenge. That's frustrating. I need to get Scrooge McDuck to level four. Okay, so that means he's almost to level four, probably. Vanellope, I will do the Dream Snaps challenge. Maybe later. Probably. Probably at the end. We'll do the Dream Snaps challenge at the end. But right now, I need to go get a hang on my controls, first of all. <clears throat> We're gonna go get Scrooge McDuck, see if he wants to hang out. Where the hell is that guy? Marco! Polo! Does anybody else play Marco Polo with themselves, or was I just a sad child growing up? <laughs> um. Where the hell is he? Is he always in a store? Sometimes I see him around. The first two times I tried to load this game to record, it froze. <laughs> uh, just so you know, I want to hang out with you. Can we? Let's hang out. Do you have a favorite gift for the day? That's another way to get them up a level. Uh, I can't pronounce- a green salad. Can I make that? I don't think I have lettuce, but... Let's go mine stuff and I'll see if I have lettuce. This can take a lot of time, I think. But I'm gonna try to make it quick. Cause I've done this kind of before. Ah, green salad. Nice. Here, Scrooge. Take your salad. Your rabbit food. I don't think salad is really that great for people. Not as good as they think it is. Okay, level four. Yay! What do I get? Coins! Not bad, not bad. I wouldn't mind level seven. I get 1k coins. That would be nice. Give me all the money, Scrooge. Press any button. And I'm level six, look at me go. Okay. Oh. Yay, oh, that means I can level him up. Ever since we lost our memories, I can't recall the combination. Huh? I left myself this note under the register with instructions on how to find it again. But I don't remember the answers to the clues. Will you help me jog my memory? Let's do it. And might I say, you've, you have a splendid attitude. Now everything you need to know to find my six digit safe combination is on that note. Why, thanks. Okie dokie. A forgotten combination. Let's do this. Ask Goofy about his favorite day. Take a bit of fresh air. Now I can't see it, but that's fine. Because we don't need to see, right? Take a bit of fresh air in the meadow and count the ponds. How many telescopes does one wizard need to study the stars? What does any of that mean? That doesn't tell me what I have to do. That's just a really weird way of saying things. Oh. Oh! Ask Goofy about his favorite day. He's going to tell me a number. Where is he? Let's go, Scrooge. Oh my god! Where's Goofy? Goof? Is that Donald over there? No, it's a lunchbox on the ground. That's hilarious. I thought it was Donald throwing a fit. 
Oh, is he inside or behind his house? I think he might be behind his house. Aye, right, let's leave. My watch wants me to stand up, but my timer says my lasagna has five more minutes. So I refuse. Hi, Goofy! Howdy. How's it going? Oh, a forgotten combination. Oh, hey there, Jessica, what can I do for you? I need to know what your favorite day of the year is. My favorite day of the year, let me think. Whoa. Oh, I know, it's May 25th. Can't rightly recall why, though. Gorge. I could use some help. Okay. So, 25, 1, 2, 3. So, 25, 3. How many telescopes does one wizard need to study the stars? I think maybe we have to go into Merlin's house. Would you think so? Or would you just talk, would I just talk to Merlin? I don't know. We're gonna see. What is it? 25, 3... One. I'm gonna pick up this memory though. What up? I don't know what that was. A memory? Sure. Knock me over with a feather. You found the numbers. Hurry, let's piece together the combination. The first clue you had was to ask Goofy about his favorite day. Did you? Yeah, it was May 25th. That, that would be 2505. Now for the next clue. How many ponds did you count in the meadow? Three. That's right. I hope the fresh air did some good. And finally, the telescopes. Just one is enough. <laughs> Eureka! 250531. That's my combination. So genius. Nobody could guess it. Even me. Uh -huh. Now forget those numbers straight away. I've got property to protect. Yes, I'm just gonna forget the numbers because that's what. Yeah, sure. I'll do that. <clears throat> but I do want to thank you. Now that I have access to my fortune, here's a wee gift. What are you gonna give me? Like two cents? 500 pennies? Wow. A forgotten combination! Complete! Are you level five yet? What if I give you a gift? I have something to give you. A flower. Oh, that was easy. I forgot that you can do that. You can just give them like, I think flowers do help increase them more than most other things. Then we'll have one of our characters at level five. Yay. Fantastic. We get that cute little dresser thing. We'll hutch. Okay, let's check our quest log again. Cause Okay, now he's locked again because we have to unlock characters. We have to unlock Ursula and we have to level up Mick Scrooge to level 6. And we have to progress further with Merlin and Ursula and unlock some biomes. So there's a lot to do to unlock him again. Um, uh, I think I have everything I need for Remy. I just don't have it in my pockets. So I have to go grab that. And then we can complete the restaurant makeover. Or at least this part of it. Finding the ingredients for Chez Remy. Which is 10 oregano, 15 carrots. And what are they inside? over here okay carrots wheat oregano i don't know raspberries okay bring them to remy it took me a minute to collect all that not gonna lie there's only two biomes it's really frustrating he's running away from me we have to be faster than a mouse Do -do -do. Bonjour. Bonjour. We have everything we need to open. 
Let's head to the front of the restaurant and make it happen. We work well in Okie dokie. Where's the restaurant? Oh, right. I think it's up here. Oh, it's behind here. Um. Oh, he's right here. Oh, do we have to go in? My bad. I think I have to talk to him. I accidentally went inside instead. Maybe he'll follow me. Did he? Or is that Scrooge? Oi. Hmm. This is definitely a glitch. Okay, we're opening the restaurant. I'm ready. Oh, Remy is underneath Scrooge's butt. Right now. Hold on, gotta go through my mental checklist one more time. Huh? Wait, do we have salt? Did I forget to get salt? We can't open a restaurant without salt. We have salt. You sure? Okay, then I think we're good. Here we go. The Ches Remy restaurant is now open. Let's head inside. Yay! Upgrade Remy's restaurant. Dream light. Yo, I need all the dream light. There's so much stuff to unlock. I'm so behind. Talk to Remy. Oh, Scrooge. I need to talk to Remy. Oy vey. Okay, we can't hang out anymore. I have to hang out with you later, Scrooge. Because now Remy is stuck under your butt and I can't do anything about it. Oh, those paintings are cool. I do like those. Remy! Bonjour. Tables, chairs, food. We have opened a restaurant. Mm. I know I've done this before, but it's still really special. I can't wait to get my first customer. Yay! Remy's level one. Mm. I could hang out with him for a while. That'll help him. Oops. Can I hang out with him? Is he high enough level for me to do that? Oh, no, I can't. Did you know that when it comes to fresh ingredients, Ches Remy is the first Goofy to Table restaurant? Goofy to Table? <laughs> yeah, Goofy's stall provides me with all the freshest ingredients. Uh -huh. Of course, I have to import some rare items through Mr. McDuck. Which can be a bit expensive. It's worth it for quality ingredients, though. You're right, of course. <laughs> the price is worth it to create a world-class culinary experience. Yay, we're level two. Okay, I think we're gonna give you foraging because I don't know, he's a mouse, right? So, okay, he's a rat, but let's be nice, okay? I feel like that's a mean word. He's a mouse, he's just a big mouse. Okay, let's hang out, Remy. We're gonna get you to level five, but let's get out of here. McDuck is just staring at your, like, tea set. It's a little weird. What do we have? Who else do we have to quest with? I might actually have villagers that are pretty close to level 5, so... Merlin, Mickey... So it would probably be Mickey... Did I already do that? No. It was McDuck. And then, let's see... Mickey. We, let's craft a tall birdhouse. At Goofy's stall. And we'll try to level Mickey. And then hang out with Remy at the same time. Let's see how this goes. Okay. And the birdhouse. Place the tall birdhouse in the village. Hold on a second. Okay. Place the tall birdhouse in the village. Here, we'll put it right over here. Right there. Wow, see that, Mickey? 
see what Mickey thinks. <laughs> I thought it said, see that, Mickey? No, that's not what that said. Where'd the guy go? Is he at home? Why do I always think everybody's at home? No, he's at the center over here. Sup, Mickey? Gosh, that birdhouse looks so good. I kind of wish I was a bird. I wish I was a bird too sometimes, Mickey. It sure is exciting to think that everybody's starting to come back, but there's actually nobody in particular that... But there's actually somebody in particular that I'm especially waiting for. My sweetheart, Minnie. I was hoping to find her again when you opened the meadow, but she wasn't there. Maybe if we bring the village back to what it was, she can come back. I've been wondering where she was. Me too. She disappeared and I don't know how to find her. But now that you're here, I bet together we can get her back. There's something kind of magical about you. I can't help but be a hope but be hopeful when you're around. Congratulations. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You really knew me. <laughs> oh wait. Can't run away just yet, Mickey. We gotta get to le level five in our friendship. Which means I have to accept Ooh, this quest. I just wish that one day was today. I understand. Uh. She sure does. A guy that make that couldn't ask for a sweeter sweetheart. I miss all the things we used to do together. <laughs> like singing songs and going on picnics. Uh, that's cute. <laughs> she really she'd really like that. How about you get the food and I'll get everything else? See ya. Missing <laughs> mini. Quest started. Let's go. What do I need? I need to make a fish sandwich and crudite. Okay, so I know that a fish sandwich is wheat and fish. So I need to go get two fish because I need to get two sandwiches. So we're gonna go fishing. Are we still? Yeah, he's still hanging out with me. And Remy is still following me. And my capybara. My capybara. That is not the fish. Try again, Jess. Oh my goodness. Do I not know how to fish anymore? This is unacceptable. Okay, just one more. I probably just got some- Oh, it's a memory! That's always nice. Interesting. Next! Do do do. Let's try again, cause I can never get it. Okay, there we go. Oh goodness, that was almost too soon. Yay! Okay, and I have the wheat, so we can make our fish sandwiches. And the crudite, I believe, I can make with just carrots. But I have to make five of them? Do I have five carrots? Oh my god. I remember when I first started playing and this seemed like the hardest thing. But now that I know what I know... You know? I know. Right? One! I have five. That's perfect. But now we have to sit here and craft every one separately because that's just how it works we can try okay we'll do it that way do, 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 do. we almost got it one more after this and then we have to make the sandwiches this is not the most exciting part of the game i promise you we're going to unlock stuff a fish and a piece of wheat. I wish I could just double this recipe. I would like a fish sandwich right now.
Perfect. Bring the meals to Mickey. He's right here. Perfect. Wow, look at all the food. Follow me to the picnic spot. I found a perfect one in the peaceful meadow. Follow Mickey. Hey there, pal. How about a check? Where'd he go? He's so fast. He ran so fast. Mickey. Can I even fit through here? Barely. That was rude of you. I bet Minnie would love this. The sky, the grass, it's just her kind of picnic. <laughs> and I know she'd love being friends with you. Gosh, I miss her. Mickey, I think something is happening. Oh my god, is that Minnie? Ah, I forgot about that. That's so weird. Wow, was that Minnie? Was that really her? Where is she? Wait, Merlin and I saw something like this before. Minnie isn't gone. What is it? It must be sh the forgetting. It's not the memory. It's not just memories that are lost. Villages are starting to fade away too. We have to figure out how to bring Minnie back to the valley. And with your help, I'm sure we can do it. I need to go check in with Merlin. Let's talk about this again soon. Hey there. Let's hang out. He's almost to level five. That's that's literally villager number two. And we need to go talk to Merlin for Mickey anyway. Oh, I have to get him to level six? Oh my god. But I'm about to get him to level five. Do I have any flowers in my pocket? I have something to give you. Oh, you like tomatoes? I think I... No, I don't have tomatoes. Clam juice? Like, I'm supposed to have clam juice? <laughs> Here's a flower. He really likes flowers. Oh, boy, that's nice. Am I glad to see you? Yes, me too. Me too, Mickey. Let me just find one more flower to give you, and you should be level five. And of course, when I want a flower, there are none around. Oh, there's one. Here, this should do it. I have something to give you. Yay! Level five! Villager number two! Perfect. Oh, we get that little figurine. That's cute. Okay, one more villager. Who do we got? Because now that I have all of these quests are locked right now. Gather dream shards. I need 10 dream shards. A warm welcome. Talk to Goofy. Where is Goofy again? Right near me. What's up, buddy? Whoa. Oh boy, just imagine what we can cook with all this great with all these great ingredients. Hey. Let's make something everybody'll love. Oh. Let's cook. Okay. Cook a meal using basil or oregano. Oh, I don't have cheese or anything, so that'll be hard. Do I have basil or oregano now? I know what I can do. Oregano and... W no, not raspberries. Wheat. We'll make some kind of fancy cracker. No! Is it basil? And wheat? No! It's a plain cracker! Okay, fine. We'll use oregano. And... All. We'll use oregano. And raspberries. <laughs> that does not work. I just want you to know that. No, I want to collect the stream light. Oh, Goofy, I have a meal apparently. That worked. I didn't realize it. But okay. I have something to give you. Wait, I'm I'm confused, Goofy. I thought Oh, that's Mickey Mouse. How you doing today? Goofy. Hey there. Does that smell good? Everybody's gonna get gonna want to play 
of what I don't know what I made the raspberries with the oregano. I don't know. Level two? That's it, Goofy? Crazy. What's on your mind, man? <laughs> I've got something to tell you. I caught a real funny fish the other day. Never seen anything like it before. It was all big and puffed up. What was it? Well, I showed it to Merlin and he said it was a fugu. A fugu? A fugu? Fish? I guess it only swims up near the surface of on Dazzle Beach when it's raining. I tossed it back, but maybe you could try fishing it for it next time it rains. Ah, that's complete. Can I interest you in a hangout, Goofy? So that we can level you up? What would you like as a gift? Garlic, fish, steak, and catfish. Fish steak. Oh, well, apparently that that's fine too. That worked just as well. Hold on, I'm just gonna keep giving you everything in my pocket. Do do do. Crackers? Oh boy, he likes crackers too. Okay. That was oregano and raspberries. I just want to let you know that. And now he's already level three. Can you believe it? Can you believe this? This is the third character already. Look how good I am. Let's give him more crackers. This guy really likes food. How did I not know that? Can I give him raspberries? Will he? He doesn't like raspberries as much. I should just make some crackers. Because I don't have garlic. Those biomes are not unlocked. Wheat crackers. Fruit salad. Will that be enough? Yay! See, that helped. That helped a lot. But I don't know if I made enough to get him to level 5. Does Mickey just hang out at Goofy's house all the time? We need a whole nother level. We could just hang out Goofy. We're literally one level away. This is Goofy's favorite pastime. It'll help level. Oh, I think he wants a catfish too. That might help us get him to level five quicker. Yay, more catfish. What's up, Goofy? Starting a scrapbook for us. But making a scrapbook sure takes a lot of creativity. I'm super creative. That doesn't surprise me. You always struck me as a creative type. Why don't you take some pictures of the village for our scrapbook? It'd be great if we had some pictures of plants. Cool. We'll do Goofy, but I have something for you. Yay! That is literally almost level five. Look at that. 
I am level eight. Am I always above my characters? I'd hope so if I'm ruling the area. One more catfish? Not as good. But we're close, Goofy! Raspberries! That wasn't very much at all. Does anybody spy a flower around here? I mean, I guess maybe if I stand here and fish... Here we go, Goofy. He's in the picture still. He's right here. Yay! Oh, he gave me another fish. We got him to level five. That was villager number three. Now let's go talk to Merlin. <laughs> You've accomplished a great feat nurturing your friendships, Jessica. The village would be all the better for it. Well, come on, come on. No time to dilly-dally. We must go back to the pillar, recover the orb, and lift the curse of the meadow. <laughs> A fine day indeed. Go back to the pillar in the meadow. Okay. On my way. <clears throat> ah! Whoa! This is just root beer. I don't really know what root beer is made of. I should Google that. Go back to the pillar in the meadow. Here we are. Goofy, would you look at this? What is this? Place the orb of friendship in the pillar. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh. What the hell was that noise? <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Go check on the well in the meadow. Okay. Oh, look. We did the... Me not paying attention. Running slowly. Our zoom zoom's not there. Here we are, Marilyn. Hello. Hello. Stupendous. You succeeded. The well is free of the curse. You know, the old ruler used the wells to travel by magic around the village from well to well. I prefer to wander. Indeed, wandering is when I think my best thoughts, but you can always use the wells when you need to get somewhere fast. Speaking of wandering, replacing the orb of friendship removed the dark magic from the giant night thorns blocking the way into the rest of the valley. Whew, say that ten times fast. Whew. A lot of lung, lung capacity for that. If you gather enough dreamlight, you can get rid of the giant night thorns to explore farther. In the time... And in time, we should be able to discover what happened to the others who stayed behind. I seem to remember when the valley fell into chaos, the sea witch stayed by the beach. Did you just say sea witch? Sounds scary. Oh, you should be weary of her. She can be a bit tricky. The sea witch may hold many of the answers we seek. I suggest you start by exploring the beaches to the south. <laughs> To the south we go. Ooh, we unlocked it. Look at us. Most powerful wizard. Never eat shredded wheat. So is it this way or is it this way? This way or this way? I think it's this way. Gain access to a new biome. Well, it's been quite a 
It's been quite a while so far, and we did a lot. So I'm going to leave it off here, and I hope you like and subscribe. We're going to open up some biomes next time. Thank you.